Well, two county women stepped out on faith and opened a business together. Now, almost 10 years later, they are thriving. CTV's Katera Jones talks with the co-owners of New Digs Consignment in Upper Marlboro about how they did it. Starting a business from the ground up isn't easy and it takes a lot of hard work, but for two county women, their dedication to their vision has led them to not only one store, but two. Really, it, it hit off in college is when I started shopping consignment and I've always dreamt of having a consignment or some type of boutique. It all started with an idea from Kelly Queen. She wanted to partner with Sadiqa Brown to open up a consignment store. But Brown wasn't initially on board with the idea. When she took me to um, the other consignment shop, I'm like, we could do this. And that birthed us the rest of 10 years later. Once Brown agreed, it took them a year to find their Upper Marlboro location. Queen credits her faith in God with bringing the perfect place, which they have been in for almost 10 years. People still to this day say, why are you in this small development or why are you on the end? But God has sent us here. I remember finding it and I remember sitting in the parking lot and I called Sadiqa, like literally a year later we found it. And I said, we found this, I think this is the spot. Also, in the early stages of their business, the pair made a bold move. They completely self-funded their store. But how much does opening a retail store actually cost? Well, I would say uh, north of 100000 How much would you say? <laughs> Yeah, all of, our, <laughs> all of our pennies. All of yeah. our, all of our yeah. coins. So it wasn't like yeah. we just oh, did yeah, $100,000 yeah. down. It was over time. And the business um, for, I mean, within the first two or three uh, months, it at least paid for itself. But that's all it paid for. And you can tune in to CTV News tomorrow to learn more about these dynamic women and how they pivoted their business during the global pandemic.